this tutorial I'm going to go over two scripts that display Hello World in Blender. This is the second script and when I run it, even though the cube is selected, the text changes to Hello World. So how do I make a Hello World Python script? Well, I'm going to click New to start afresh. This is Choose scr Screen Layout and there are layouts for animation, game logic, we want scripting layout. Now this is Blender 2.57 and there are two Python console windows. Not much point having two Python console windows so I'm going to change one of them to an info window. I'm going to change the view to top view and I'm going to delete the cube by pressing delete on the keyboard and if you notice there is the command to delete an object I'm going to add text and there is the command to add text I can copy that by pressing Control and C on the keyboard and if I come into the console I can paste from the clipboard now if I delete this text pressing delete again uh, I can rerun the command from the console just by hitting enter and that command is run and the text is added the Python commands that we run in the Python console can be put together in the text editor window to form Python scripts. The first thing we do is click the plus to start a new script. I'll call this hello world 1.py. Press enter. Uh, that command is still in the clipboard, so if I go to edit uh, paste, now there are an awful lot of parameters there and you don't need any of them, they will all uh, default if you delete them uh, but you'll still add the text. I will leave the location and rotation there because they might be useful uh, to alter the location and rotation of the text. Now here is the run script button, now I could try and run that now but I know it won't work because you have to import the Blender API which is import Python API and that should work now but first of all I'll delete the text then I'll run the script and the text comes back. Okay we can add text but how do we get the text to say hello world? Well, we need to see how to do that in Blender so to edit text in Blender you need to go into edit mode and then you can delete the text and type in what you like okay and then I go back to object mode so let's have a look at the commands that uh, I've just done there's the first one, it toggles into edit mode. Then it uh, does font delete and deletes the previous selection. And then it does font insert and it inserts each character. And then it toggles out of edit mode back to object mode. So now I'm going to copy and paste these commands into my Python script, making changes as necessary. Top tip is to make sure that nothing has been left on selected. Um, so now the first thing I want to copy is the toggle into edit mode. So Control C on the keyboard and Control V in the text editor window. Uh, then I want a delete command, control C, cont 
control V. Now, um, that will only delete one character, but from trial and error, I found if you have no parameters, it will delete all the text. Back to the info window. Um, just select one thing, control C, into the text window, control V. Now again, uh, in trial and error, I found you can put all the text in one insertion. And now we need to toggle out of uh, edit mode, control C in the info window, control V. So if I delete that, delete key and run the script, do I get hello world? I do. The Python script will be saved internally unless you specify otherwise. And so if I save this file, it will, and if I do new and then bring it back, everything is there as it was. I'm going to open the file that I showed you at the beginning of the tutorial and the cube is selected but this script will select the text and change it. So if I run that script the text changes to hello world. Uh, this line is the critical line. It selects an object whose name is text. Um, the rest of the script is the same as the other one. Toggle into edit mode, delete the text insert the new text and toggle back to object mode. Where did I get this line that changes the active object? Well, uh, if you go to the Blender website, Education and Help, there is the Python API reference for version 2.5. And here, an introduction to Blender for Python can be found at Quick Start Intro. And most of the important points on the basics of Python scripting are here, including, if we scroll down, there's a context section, and that's where I got that line from, that will change the active object. The final point I want to make is the difference between the Blender Python API and the Blender Game Engine Python API. Now, uh, here I'm importing BPY, which imports the Blender Python API, and you can use its uh, commands to access Blender code to do various things. But these scripts will always be uh, batch scripts. Uh, you won't be able to interact with them at runtime. Now, uh, if you want to interact, you have to use the Blender Game Engine a API. So if I load an example uh, and that for that you use import BGE blender game engine and you can use the BGE Python calls to blender code and that blender code you can interact with at runtime it will respond to events and you can uh, program event handling routines there is nothing to stop me putting into this script import BPY and I could put calls in to the Blender Python API. Uh, the, when you ran the script you wouldn't get errors. You would be in, When you're in game mode you wouldn't see any effect of the commands and when you escaped you would then see the effects of the commands because they'll only run in batch mode, they won't run interactively. I have also uploaded a tutorial that shows you how to say hello world using the Blender game engine. 
That's the end of this tutorial. Thanks for watching. I'll put all the files on my website freemovies.co.uk at the Blender channel.